absolutely fascinating way. Yeah. So you, you always get that sort of modern, most modern stuff at the conference. Yeah. Um, last year we had people there from um, all the way from New Zealand, oh, we had people from Holland, yeah. from Germany, yeah. from France. Mm -hmm. Um, I think also one from America. Yeah. Um, and, and this year you'll get a lot more with the when we put the interviews out. I hope and so. And that's what I really like about it because there's so many people in America doing this kind of change work and uh, working through language and linguistics and uh, hypnosis, NLP and stuff like that that are interested. Yeah. So I'm very excited to be able to present you to them. Right. The conference, by the way, is the 12th and 13th of September 2009. So there's plenty of time yeah. to book your tickets now. Now, again, can we just say your website? Is yeah. it cleanchange? www.cleanchange.co.uk And so if you're interested in going to the conference, which is um, September, did you say? September 12th and 13th. September 12th and 13th. You've still got plenty of time to book it right now on your website. Yes. Uh, as well as the many, many, many trainings that you have going on. Yeah, we have, uh, in particular for an international audience, we have a summer school in Cambridge. Oh, tell us about that. Which is uh, 14 days. We do the first four modules plus certification. Why Cambridge? Um, it seemed like a nice venue. And we've, oh, yeah. Because like, that's there. my hometown, you know, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> we've now been there, um, yeah. well, this will be our third year. Yeah. It turned out to be absolutely perfect oh, for good, us in good. terms of, yeah, yeah. it's a beautiful atmosphere, it's yeah. such a beautiful city. Um, but the venue we've got is yeah. just a little bit out of the city centre and it's oh, set fantastic. in a beautiful garden oh, with windows all the way oh, round. And we can just go out and sit in the garden yeah. and, uh, and do our work or whatever. Yeah, so it's worth coming, if you're coming from out of the country, even Cambridge is beautiful. University town, so you get the chance to see the city as well when you come to Cambridge. And also do the fantastic training in the beautiful environment that you're describing. Mm. That's great. Oh, you stay in St Catherine's College, do you know it? I don't. I don't know, there's so many colleges. <laughs> I know King's College. It's, it's near yeah. there. Is it? Yeah. yeah so the, the famous King's College yeah. chapel where mm -hmm. they do the Christmas service yeah. is just a uh, uh, hundred yards from where oh, we so stay. Oh, it's fantastic then. <laughs> Very good location. Mm. So, so what else are you doing as far as trainings? What else can we invite people to come to? Well, we often do uh, introductory teleclasses. Oh, big deal. So people can phone people in from worldwide. all over the world. Yeah. Um, so you can have an experience of clean yes, language, you yeah. don't need to come here to do it. Try it out first, right? Mm. Yeah. And we're hoping that in the future we'll be able to offer more trainings that way as well. Yes, yes. Fantastic. Um, we, we haven't done it yet, but yes. certainly our, our intention is oh, to sure. get people started on the training yeah. at least over the phone by the way. Yeah. Um, yeah, so modules one, two, three, four, the first ten days of our yeah. training, first two days it's about introducing clean language, it's about getting used to metaphor, listening out for metaphors, hearing those metaphors. Modules two and three we get into um, how do you help people to change using clean language. Mm -hmm. As a coach or as a manager, yeah. how do you make that change environment I like that allows that. them to change? Now, just to be clear, you don't need an NLP background Absolutely to do not. clean language, do you? Absolutely not. So if I were a manager, or let's say um, when you were in the position before, you were a manager and you were looking for something to quickly solve a problem or be a part of a training program, mm -hmm. is clean language useful in that context? Very useful. Oh. So as I was saying, PricewaterhouseCoopers yes. are, are using it in just that way. Okay. They're not getting engaged really in metaphor Love using it. clean language. Love but they are using the clean language questions. Fantastic. They're using something similar to um, a model devised by Lynn Cooper, yes. who wrote the uh, Business NLP for Dummies yes. recently. Yes. She's got a model she calls the Five Minute Coach, yes. which is based on some of the clean language questions. Yes. Um, and it really does get down to the nitty gritty of what do you want to have happen? Yeah. What needs to happen to make that happen? And can it happen? God, it's easy stuff, isn't it? You just need the right <laughs> questions, right? Mm. Just a little bit of direction, I love that. And so that can be found in Lynn Cooper's NLP... Business Bus NLP for Business Dummies. NLP for Dummies, yeah. which is a fantastic book, yeah. right? A similar version yeah. of that was actually trained to uh, the leaders of Weight Watchers clubs. Oh, yes, tell us um, about Because you know, one of those weight management clubs, yes. you each, each leader only has like a minute with, it, yes. with each participant. Yes. Um, and they wanted something that they could do to really get the participants actively right. engaging yes. with goals for the next week. Right, right. So what they came up with was um, 
what they call the one minute motivator. Mm -hmm. So this is Wendy, my business partner, plus uh, Marion Way and Phil Swallow, who are both clean language enthusiasts. Yes. They came up with one minute motivator, which again is, what would you like to have uh -huh. in the next week? Yes, love it. And can that happen? Love it, absolutely love it. Now, what's the, um, I understand that you have different modules, and you said 22 days all together. Yeah. Now, how would I become a clean language specialist myself and be able to teach other people about clean language? Um, you can, there's, there's no restriction, there's no sort of formal restrictions mm -hmm. on clean language. Mm -hmm. David Grove, its inventor, was very generous with his ideas and his mm -hmm. time and uh, he didn't copyright or trademark any mm. of this stuff. Wow. So okay. anybody can mm. decide that they want to teach people a little okay. bit about this stuff and mm -hmm. they can. Um, clean Change Company is hoping in the future to have more um, trainers out there training the way we yes. train. Yes. So we've got a group in Holland at the moment yes. who do train under our, our brand, if oh, you like. Oh, that's fantastic. Um, yeah. I can't pronounce the name of their company in <laughs> Dutch, unfortunately. I, I name check them. But, uh, but it's important, isn't it? To have a, um, it? It's nice to have a sort of um, an understanding of what, you can, what can be expected from one of your trainings or one of your trainees' training. Mm -hmm. I think, Especially uh, as it expands in the future. Because it is, it is open. I don't want it to stop anyone from training. No. If yeah. they, all they've done is read the book, yeah. why on earth shouldn't they share Teach it with somebody everyone they else. know? Definitely. And yeah. if you want to learn at the highest level, yeah. you want to learn from people who have trained at the yeah. highest level, who've yeah. got the experience. Yeah. Like Wendy, my business partner, yeah. who's done 10 years or so of yeah. this stuff. Yeah. Trained directly with Penny and James and yeah. with David. Mm. And, and you. Well. I can't claim to be the world's greatest expert. I've been involved well, in this stuff two, two or three years. Yeah. I'm not a psychotherapist. Mm -hmm. I'm an enthusiast. Yeah. My job is to tell people about it, right. yeah. <laughs> as well as to start to train. I do train yeah. on the, uh, the on the earlier modules. I, I don't train on the advanced stuff. The yeah. what they call participants call them the Jedi modules. Oh which right, channeling yeah. the force. <laughs> <laughs> highly skilled stuff. I think even today we've learned such a lot from you that we didn't know before. So I, I appreciate it myself. I'm sure everybody else does too. Okay, and what else can we expect from Clean Change um, in the next few years? Ooh, well, the sky's the limit to some extent yeah. because I think the re response to the book has been so fantastic. Were you surprised? Pleasantly surprised, yeah. yes. Um, I don't think I really believe that uh, yeah. Amazon number one was possible. Yeah. Um, For your first baby as well. It was yeah. quite funny. We, uh, I don't know whether you've come across the, the deliberate campaigns that people do to get to number one in their category. You know, when they do mass emails <laughs> and things. Yes. And we seriously considered doing one of yeah. those. Yeah. Um, with a colleague of ours in the Coventry who was going to organise it for us. Mm. And we owned and we awed and we wrote it on our calendar for when it was going to be, and it was going to be in early March 2009. We'd do that campaign. And we'd be at Amazon number one, and then yeah. other things would happen. Yeah. Oh, we ran out of time, we ran out of energy, we couldn't do it. Yeah. And went. So we never ran the campaign oh, that to get to number one. Still, we but we still did one. it. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> High five to that. <laughs> You go, girl. I absolutely love it. So anyone who yeah. believes in the whole manifesting thing can make what they like of that. I, I love that. <laughs> now, lastly, is there anything that you can tell um, some of our viewers a little bit about clean language? Perhaps they're interested in finding out more about clean language or even just making change happen in their life. Is there any advice that you could give them? Um, <clears throat> apart from get the book, get the cards, um, I would say to get their attention onto this question, this pretty language question, which is, what would you like to have happen? Love it. Focus on that. Focus.